I got a bag of fish crisp. Poured it in there. Nice little seasoning and a batter. Yeah, anyways, fish. Yeah. Now we just shake, shake it up. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Shake it up. Do, do, do. Come on, let's twist again. Like it did last summer. Ooh, let's twist again. Like we did last year. Do you remember when? Oh, we were really humming. Yeah, let's twist again. Like we did last year. Do, 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 do. Boom. Done. What a spectacular day. Shathani Lake didn't disappoint. Absolutely serene. To stand in some of the same places as those that came before us had a real sense of power to it. This campsite was really proving to be one of the best of the entire trip stands out in my mind as one that I'll remember for the rest of my life. Completing Shitani Lake represented the last of the large lakes of our trip, with only four kilometers left to go to the Seal River. Delicious fish dinner made it all that much better. A little Cajun fish crisp and some Frank's buffalo were all the luxuries we need. Hike for dinner. We were feeling pretty darn good. Gonna throw a can of beans on the fire here in a second. And we're going to cook some uh, Frida pie tonight. So, as a matter of fact, I'll throw the can of beans on right now. Can of chili. And uh, it's an easy, easy dinner. But, uh, yes, that's the plan. And these should dry pretty quick. The jeans are completely dry and the chili is completely cooked, so we are about to move on to the next phase of living in the tent. Alright, the jeans are dried, the chili's hot, and uh, I'm going to do something called a Frito pie tonight. I don't have Fritos here, I have corn chips, which are the same general idea. And uh, slice the bag down one side. I'm going to break them up just a little bit so there's not huge chunks of uh, chips in there. And step two is the chili. Pipe and hot Texas style chili. Alright. So now we got that in there. I'm gonna uh, set her down for a sec. Because the next required ingredient if you want to be a true Texan about this, is cheese. Now, they stop there. 
after the cheese. And this is a great camping meal. Because cook, cook it right on the stove from a can and put it in a bag. So, got a lot of cheese in there. But you can never have too much. Other optional toppings include sour cream, which I'm going to do. And uh, chopped onions, uh, jalapeno peppers, whatever you might want to throw onto this thing. But uh, I think I think what I've got here is gonna work just fine. Now this is a meal and a half. It really is. Uh, super convenient. Cook it right in the bag. Fantastic. If, it, if nobody's had uh, Frito pie before, well, it's chili and corn chips with uh, toppings served in the bag. But uh, works out real good for me. A super easy meal. Here we are again. Uh, gonna saute some veggies with a little red uh, Sinbin red ale. Mm -hmm. Beautiful wife doesn't really like green peppers, so I'm doing these separately because I like them. Uh, but uh, the red peppers and onions will certainly need a little flavor. We'll see if these will cook on here. And we sit by the fire sure is a beautiful night. Uh, it's chilly, but by the fire, it's quite okay. Well, flashlight's running out of batteries, but we're gonna put a bunch of food into this uh, French bread loaf here. Got uh, sauteed peppers and uh, onions. Montreal smoked meat, uh, Swiss cheese, we'll put it in between the slices here, wrap it in foil, throw it on the fire. Can't get easier than that. Here it is, a humongous sandwich, uh, kind of cooked under the fire. I'll try and cut in between the uh, perforations and yeah, make a bunch of little sandwiches out of this. Okay. Well, there we go. We got one out of there. Looks pretty good, actually. That's a decent looking sandwich. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This sandwich, um, I'll give a camping Michelin star on this, a hunker down Michelin star. This is uh, really, really good beautiful wife has already snacked on a few things and she's actually asleep so this will be a midnight snack or breakfast for her mm. could have stayed on the fire longer but uh, it is getting late and uh, it's still snowing a little bit I can see pieces of snow coming down so can't wait to crawl into the tent 
and hunker down for the night. Mm -hmm.